Hey guys, if you're looking for how you can run Java programs in your favorite Visual Studio code, then you are in the right place. Watch this video until the end because I'm about to show you step by step process to configure Visual Studio code for running Java programs correctly. And I'm also gonna show you how you can run two basic Java program in Visual Studio code on Mac machine. So without further ado, let's get started. Firstly, we have need to download and install the latest version of JDK. To download it, copy this link. I have provided this link in the video description. Now open up your favorite web browser. I am using Google Chrome here. Then paste the copied link into the search bar and hit enter. This is the official page for downloading the latest version of Java Development Kit. Now click on this JDK download link. It will redirect you to Java SE Development Kit downloads page. Scroll down a little bit and you can see we have here download links for various operating systems like Linux and here our Mac OS. Currently it size is 175 MB. Click on this download link. Check I have reviewed and accept the license agreement and finally click on this long green download button. And now you can see our JDK installer DMG file is started downloading here. It will take some time to download. All depend your internet connection speed. Our JDK installer setup file is downloaded successfully. Click on show in finder. We need to install this file. Simply double click on this file. Now double click on this pkg file and will start the setup wizard. Let me close all other windows so that we can focus on installation part. It says welcome to the JDK installer. Click on continue button and then click on install button. Enter your Mac password here and click on install software button. It will take some time to install. It says JDK successfully installed. Now we can click on close button. We don't need this package anymore. Now we can click on move to trash button. Good job. Now let's check Java is working or not. Open the terminal by pressing command plus space and write terminal in the search bar and hit enter. Now let's first check for the Java version. Here type Java space hyphen hyphen version and press enter. And if you see something like this, then congratulations. You have successfully installed Java on your Mac machine correctly. Now let's check for Java C. Type Java C space hyphen hyphen version and press enter. As you can see, we have the latest Java C version installed here. Now I'll show you how you can download and install Visual Studio code on Mac machine. You can skip this part if you have already installed Visual Studio code and directly jump to Java configuration part. Copy this link and open your browser and paste the copied link into the address bar and hit enter. This is the official page for downloading Visual Studio code. To download it, Click on this blue download for Mac button and now you can see our VS code zip file started downloading here. It's around 91 megabyte file at the time of recording. Our VS code file is downloaded successfully. Click on this up arrow and select show in finder. Let me close all other windows so that we can focus on installation part. We need to install this file. Simply double click on this file and it will start the expanding process. Now drag this file to the application folder in the navigation panel. You can open the Visual Studio code by pressing command plus space and write Visual Studio code and hit enter. We have successfully installed Visual Studio code on Mac. Ok, now let's configure Visual Studio code for running Java program. For that, firstly we need to install Java extension pack in the Visual Studio code. Press this button. 
and in the search bar type java and choose java extension pack make sure it is from microsoft now press on this small green install button this java extension pack install visual studio intellicode language support for java debugger for java and all necessary components wait for it to install and it's all done here now let's write some basic java program in the visual studio code for testing create a new file by pressing command plus n and click on file and select save as give a name to your file i am writing subscribe.java just don't forget to add .java at the end of the file for java code otherwise it won't work and then click on save let me quickly type a basic java program that prints subscribe now to run the program simply click on this small play button and it works see subscribe now is printed here if you followed the steps in this video and reach until here i am assuming this method has been working for you so i am requesting you to please like the video and subscribe to my channel it won't cost you anything but it will definitely boost my morale for making more such videos okay now let's create another program which takes input from the user for that create a new file by pressing command plus n and then click on file and select save as I'll name this file input program.java and then click on save. Okay, here I'm writing the code for the program that asks the user for its first name and last name and finally prints full name of the user back to the output console. Now, run the code by pressing run play button. Let me type my first name here. Now the last name and now you can see my full name is printed here. So this is how you can run Java program in Visual Studio Code. If you are interested in learning more about Java language then be sure to check out our beginners Java programming course at the first link in the description. Subscribe and turn on the notifications so you don't miss more videos helping you to learn how to code and become a successful programmer. And I'll see you in the next video. Take care.